everyone welcome back to my channel today I decided I would show you guys just like my everyday makeup routine um what I do every day to my face and I decided I should I would do a video and show you guys what I do the first thing I do is of course prime my face um I usually just use the Revlon photo ready primer just squirt some on my finger and I take this, rub it all over my face. I usually wash my face first too and, you know, to get ready for the day, wash my face and then I just go and pound it with a bunch of chemicals. but. Gotta do something to look good. Then I shoot. Forgot my beauty blender. Then I take my beauty blender. I wet it first just because it gives it, makes it way better. And yeah, it's just way better. Then I take the matte poreless foundation in the shade 125. I just got this actually. So let's see, then I put it on the back of my hand and I just take my finger and dab it all over my face. The lighting might be a little weird because I have a sunlight or is that not sunlight, skylight right above me and it's just Take the leftover and just rub it into my neck. Cause you want your neck and your face to match, okay? Then I just start pounding my face and blend this all in. And I actually love this foundation and it's very affordable because you know your girl needs affordable products because I ain't no Kylie Jenner and I just go pound it all into my face then I usually take this powder here and I take it with my kabuki brush just pound it and pound it all over my face just to kind of set my whole face so I don't, you know, crease and look all shady. I do that. Then I have this Believe bronzer. I just got it from I think Dollar General. It, there, it's just like a new line and I actually kind of like it. It works very well. Oh, I don't want to use that brush. I want to use this brush. It's a little better. And then I just contour. And if you're pregnant, you know, you got to contour your chin because, you know, if you don't, it looks like you have five chins. So I just contour these so much. Do that and then I do this. And then I do up here too. Just to give my all over face, you know, a nice bronzy glow. There. Done, done, done. Now this is just what I do every day. So it's not like I do a very glam look because ah, who has time? And sometimes like this, this isn't really like, you can see it a little bit, but it's not, you know, sharp enough. Then sometimes I just take the elf, I have an elf, whoo, 
Almost dropped it. Good grief. The mirror or the top broke off. So yeah, so I have this e.l.f. palette and I usually take this shade and just do a little bit on my brush and just like darken the corner a little bit more just to make it look a little better. And then in the summertime, I of course use some blush because everybody likes their cheeks to be a little rosy. So I use a L'Oreal True Match blush. And let me open this. Just take a little bit on my fluffy brush and just do this. Cute. And then I do my eyebrows. Mm -hmm. And then I use the L'Oreal eyebrow stuff in the shade. I don't know what shade. I don't know what shade, but it's in a nice shade that matches my eyebrows. And yeah, I use this. And for my eyebrows, I'm letting them grow out right now. That's why they look kind of shabby. Because I want to get them shaped nicely. So I'm just... I just go and fill them in, try to make them look the best I can with what I've got, you know. And that looks good to me. So I just close that puppy up. I know what I forgot, people. My under eyes. I just need to go ham. This is like a cream stick, and I love it. I just love it so much. It covers my eyelids very well because my eyelids are veiny and dark. I've always had a problem with dark eyelids or and under eyes actually too. And that one works good. I think it's from Estee Lauder. Mm -hmm. It's just like a cream contour stick. And sometimes I blend it out with my finger because it's easier. I knew I was forgetting something. There. Now let's take my brush that has some powder on it still and just brush it over it a little bit. Make it look a little better. And then I go in with the eyeshadow. Now, um, I use a lot of different eyeshadows. I mean, depends on how I feel when I wake up in the morning. That's the kind of eyeshadow I use. So today I, I have another thing from that Believe um, company so I'm just going to use this nice cute little palette and I take my brush yeah I just throw my brushes all over every morning you know just to kind of um, get the use out of them I got it okay so the first thing I do I usually go in with this shade right here the darker shade Actually, I don't. Going with this light shade. Put it all over my eyelids. Like that. Okay? Then I go in with the darker shade. And I do this. Put it like on my outer. I actually put it in through my whole crease. And like flare it out a little bit. I know some makeup people that actually know how to do makeup are just cringing right now. Like, girl, you need help. I know I need help, but I don't have it. So I just do this. 
What the world? Okay, I don't usually go like that. But yeah. So I just continue creasing my crease. And I just do that. Then I do the same thing on the other eye. Some of you are just rending. I can see it. And then I take that same shade and I do like down here just to smoke it out. Excuse the faces I make. And I do it down here. Just to do that. And then and I take this sh shimmer shade here and I go along my brow line to add a little glitter in my life, you know? I do that. Um, I don't know why this eye is acting up. Of course it does this, you know, every day when I do it, every day it doesn't do that. Just because I'm doing a video on it, it does it. So, yeah. Then I go in with this light shade again. And I kind of like put it in here just on my lid. Take that glitter shade, put it in my inner corner, and kind of drag it out under here a little bit. I clean it up again then. Just just if you're wondering, you know, why are you looking so, um, whatever it is, I blend it out, clean it up then too. And then I take some spray. Spray it on my brush, and then I take some shimmery shadow, and well, maybe I might just use this, and then I, I'm just going to use this, I wet my brush, I'm just going to take this, and just put it on my eyelid that's not shimmery enough i'm gonna use this she shall shade that rhymed just take this and i'm just gonna pack it on my eyelid to just glam out okay Okay, that's what I do there. Then I just take my blending brush again and I kind of blend in the dark to kind of come in here a little bit, you know, do that. And then, for the best part, highlighter. I just take this and be a little bit there. A little bit there. I don't go full highlight or highlight because, you know. And I'll do that. And mascara. Can't believe I almost forgot my mascara. So, I use the Too Faced better than sex mascara because it's waterproof and if you're pregnant you'll get emotional easy and so you have to use waterproof mascara that way if you cry you don't just have black tears running down your face so let's do this I just put it on the top and the bottom and I usually do like two coats of mascara just to give your eyebrows that extra oomph. 
And of course I got some on me because that's what I do. And I just do a second coat on the top. Look at that. Ooh, that looks so good. Okay, that's what I do. And then I don't, like, I don't put lips, do anything with my lips ever. I just wear, like, chapstick or whatever. So I almost never do anything with my lips. So, so yeah, this is my finished look. Let me go and spray my face. And then I'm ready for the day and I go out and live my best life with this. Oh, I kind of forgot to clean my eyes up a little bit. Oh, they don't look that bad. Some of you are like, oh my gosh, girl, you did not just do that, but I did, okay? This is it. This is how I look. I will take you guys outside in the sun just so you guys can see it a little better because in here the lighting isn't the best so you can't see everything that well. But yeah, that's what I do for my everyday makeup look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to hit that red subscribe button down there. If it's red, turn it gray. I think it turns gray. Yeah. Well, hit the button. Let me know what color it turns in the comments. That way I know. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Thanks so much for watching. Bye!